Are you ready? You think you got this? Are you going to make us laugh really hard? All right, Brother Declan has a comedy act. Let's see if he can make Pastor laugh. Oh, I don't know. Think you got this? All right. Now first, I have a little bit of a confession to make. This is not an original act. If you want to go see the real act, um, go, go search for Matt Paul and uh, Generational Gaps. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's start. There you go. When I was younger, I was told that I could have any job that I want. I guess that's why. I'm, oh, one one thing I wanted to do is show business, and I guess that's why I'm here tonight. If you want to get into show business, do it. You're only missing one thing, talent. And that can be taught, right? That can be taught. So tonight, I want to teach you, if you want, how to get into show business. Very simple. If you want to be an actor, the first thing you must learn how to do is accents. Why? Once you learn all the accents, that's the base development for any character. Any character you want. Now, you got Every it. accent is remarkably similar. In fact, once you learn one, you pretty much learn them all. In theory, we should be able to start at one accent, go all the way around the circle, and end exactly where we started. So, I'll prove and demonstrate this. One, two, three, <coughs> you see, the first action we're going to learn how to do is high class British. You see, it's the easiest of them all to learn. It's, of course, the most fun. Because everything you say in a high class British accent sounds sophisticated. For instance, Bolter Party. See what I mean? You see, because when Declan says Bolter Party, you go, oh my, I can smell it from here. But when I say Bolter Party, you go, oh, that sounds delightful indeed. <laughs> now, what kind of a port was that, did you say? I'll take two glasses of the port, oh, porte. Wait, thank you. Now, from high class British, we can go to low class British. Here's how we do it. Start slowing our words together, kind of like a pendulum, right? Now we got on the beat, I'll sing, right? Peace, love, get up and chance. Like, oh, do it, oh, with the knife, put the knife away. They send you for ukulele, sing a folk song. Right, 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 right. <laughs> now, from low class British, what we can do is go to a very Canadian accent, right? If you want to go from here to Newby, what you do is start talking about card. You say tree instead of three. You say, boy, just go one, two, three, but the card, boy, shirty, boy, shirty, boy, one, two, three, but the card, like, but to go, tree, but to go, tree, but to go, tree, let's sing a song. Oh, card, card, one card, I love God, and I love God, oh, I sit in boats and pray to God, ask him for a book, but to God, be the tay, the tay, the tay, the tay, the tay, the Now, which people do, boys, of course, you want to go from Luffy to Irish, here's what you do. You bring yourself, oh, I'm going to to be Irish. You know, it's like Swiss Thomas Cypher once said, it's not your blood that makes the Irish, but your willingness to join the Irish nation. I disagree. I think what really makes the Irish is your willingness to hate the Scottish nation. Irish and Scottish, very different accents. Did I show you? Irish is way up here. If you want to do Scottish, you roll your eyes a little bit more. You bring your voice a little bit deeper, just like that, mate. Sure, so, and you get real unintelligent. It's got that real Scots accent there. See so right there. <laughs> what the crazy group of people in Scotland hey, wear dresses and throw walks for fun? Sure. Scottish is a very manly accent. In fact, one of the only accent in the world where you can say something like, Hey, yes, bring me the highest. And you're saying real words. <laughs> now, from the Scots here, we can go to another very manly accent. That's the southern. What you do is start taking the R off the roll and you put a toy on. Start to show tension right over there. Now, from tension, you go a little bit higher, you got to show George Wood. <laughs> a little bit higher, you got to show Dr. Field. It's going to be a changing day in your life. A little bit higher. Oh, you got to show Eddie Murphy, baby. How's everybody doing here? Yeah. Eddie Murphy, he's so funny. <laughs> Look, I actually sitting in the East Indian. Look what happened there. Oh, my goodness. What a crazy accent this is. My good Lord, boy. Uh, from East Indian, I showed you how to go eat Indian to Chinese. Eat Indian to Chinese. Indian. I showed you go eat Indian in Chinese. We each go here. One, two, one, two, one, two, one. What do you want? Number one, number two, number four. What do you want? What do you want? Open the cookie. 
Open the cookie. Open the very good fortune in there. Very good fortune. Read there, read there. Wait. What does it say? What does it say? It say tip. <laughs> now, Chinese accent, very, very different from Japanese accent. They say Chinese, Japanese, same thing. Do not same thing. See, very different. Yeah, I show you. Look, Chinese up here, Japanese and down at here. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, amazing how they have such a deeper voice. When they were such a tighter diaper. Pokemon. Oh, Pokemon. Okay. Now, from Japanese, pro or smiling. Look, we are in Russian. We are in Russian. Yes, the gutter Russian voice. Yes, yeah. Big for the big for the big for the big for the Now, from Russian to German. Show you what. From Russian to German. You start in Russian. Go look. You go to Germany, you go a little bit higher, 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 and you have yourself German! <laughs> now, the German accent is the most efficient accent in the world! Yes? Yes? You mean make the Volkswagen, yes? Yes? You like the car? Of course you do! So there we go! Now, from, now, what we do from here, we take the B's off the W, we start enunciating our words just a little a bit more clearly, and look at that, we're back at high class British where we started. I love you all so much. <laughs>